Hey y'all, it's your girl Courtney. Welcome back to my channel. Before we go any further, I need y'all to subscribe right now and go ahead and like this video. We're gonna try to get this video to, let's say 25 likes. I really think we can do it, okay? But today, I'm gonna be taking this big blown out mess and I'm gonna be turning it into some perm rods using Cream of Nature products. Peep the shirt. Shout out to Impressions of Beauty. Um, but yeah, let's get right into this video. All right, so first I'm just gonna take my four clips, divide my hair into four different sections, and I will be starting with the back. The clips are cream of nature too, okay? You're gonna be able to tell. This video is dedicated, honey. Um, before I blew my hair out, I did use the uh, milk from the lawn. I'm using the coconut milk lawn, and I used the hair milk before I blow my hair out. So that's the only product that's currently in my hair. So I'm doing these perm rods today with one product only and it's going to be the Curl Quench Foaming Mousse. It has medium hole for defined styles and this is gonna be perfect for my perm rod set because I don't want crunchy curls, like I want the soft, fluffy, big hair, you know? I'm just gonna take this section and divide it up again. I'm using like a medium size section, I guess. I'm just gonna go in and make sure it's detangled. So we don't we don't want no problems, okay? I'm gonna take some foam wrap. Not too much, because the whole point of blowing out your hair is so that it's stretched. I don't want my hair to curl back up. I want this to have length. And then I'm gonna be using orange perm rods. It's not on purpose, it just goes with the theme. And I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna start from the bottom up because I don't trust myself starting from the top. So what I do is just make sure you wrap the bottom of your hair flatly though, so that your ends are nice and straight. So I'm gonna do a little bit of just wrapping and then I'm gonna take it, and this is how you're gonna get the like, spirally look. And then the top. Stop. All right, y'all, I'm back with my front two sections left. I think I know what I'm doing now. So I'm doing medium sized sections and I also use some light orange perm rods as well, just because I don't know if I have enough of my dark orange ones. And so my light orange ones are like just a size smaller than the dark orange ones, so it shouldn't make that big of a difference. So, same old foam wrap. Okay, you forgot. Ooh, detangling. I've been adding like extra to the ends. And I really want my ends to lay flat. And then I take it. Oh. 
All right, y'all, it's the next morning, so I'm just gonna go ahead, take these down, hope for the best. That's really all I can do. And I didn't sit under a dryer or anything. I just let what was gonna happen happen. So they're all down. <laughs> this is what we have to work with. Now it's time to work some magic, okay? <laughs> okay, so all of my um, rollers are out, all my prim rods are out. So I'm gonna be separating my hair now. And I'm using the um, Essential 7 treatment oil from the same line. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to be used for this, but really you just need the oil, it really doesn't matter what kind of oil. I'm just gonna put like a little bit on my hands so that I can have minimal frizz. Cause my hair, I can already tell this is gonna be a, a somewhat frizzy style. And I'm okay with that. Cause I mean, I did a little blow dry right here. And I only really use one product. So it's kind of expected. I'm just gonna put that out the way and start separating my curls. And since this is day one hair, I don't want to separate too much, but I'm trying to look good too, so. I probably separate each piece about three times, each roller about three times. What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. <laughs> okay, so I'm completely done separating. So now I need to pick and make this look bigger. Um, and then I'll separate more if I need to. And my bangs are longer than I expected, but I want this all in my face. So I'm gonna have to pin, but y'all, I'm shook, okay? Let me back up. There we go. So y'all can see me thinner. But um, we're picking, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just picking the roots, that's all I know. Okay, there's some stuff I'm good at with this natural hair stuff, and there's some stuff that I just be winking. Fluffing my hair, I wink it. I gotta figure out some of these bangs. I'm liking the way it's looking, but it's just, see like this is too long. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do, pick it here. Like this, I'm gonna pin it up with some bobby pins. So I can have like four bangs. I'm just putting a pin right here. Oh, maybe that was too much. That's a bit. What I'm gonna do is I pin that up, but like I'm gonna pin this over here down. Does that make sense? I need some shape. Here we go. That's how I know my hair's going, because the last time I did palm rides, I did not have this issue. Now we're talking, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Okay. This is just too big. Um, 
what you're doing with it. And I feel like if I would have sat under the dryer, some of the curls would have held better. But you know, you live and you learn. It is what it is. I'm sorry, my hair looks fuller. Let's separate some more here. This is the final look using Cream of Nature products on this big voluminous primer set. Um, so yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. You know. Make sure we get this video 25 likes y'all. This, this and all my hard work, we deserve at least 25 likes, okay? And let me know if you guys wanna see more videos like this. I am open to suggestions. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.